सुनो गौर से दुनिया वालों बुरी नजर ना हम पे डालो सुनो गौर से दुनिया वालों बुरी नजर ना हम पे डालो चाहे जितना जोर लगा लो सबसे आगे होंगे हिंदुस्तानी सुनो गौर से दुनिया वालों बुरी नजर ना हम पे डालो चाहे जितना जोर लगा लो सबसे आगे होंगे हिंदुस्तानी हिंदुस्तानी हमने कहा है
का जरा सा महसूस हुआ एक लाइफ की गाड़ी ने कस के मारा ब्रेक हो रहा है क्यों कंफ्यूज मेरे दिल मशवरा मेरा तू आज के देख यही उम्र है कर ले गलती से मिस्टेक 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 बेटा
सूरज की बाहों में अब है ये जिंदगी किरने हैं सांसों में बातों में रोशनी सूरज की बाहों में अब है ये जिंदगी किरने हैं सांसों में बातों में रोशनी जो ही बदली दिल की ताल है आहा यू ही आया एक ख्याल है आहा पाते हम है जिंदगी एक बार क्यों न करे बोल के हम इस पार जाने किसका है हमें इंतजार कि जिंदगी बस कार वो ही पा गए हैं मैं और तू Can't hear you. Oops. Hello, everybody. Hey. There you go. <laughs> there you go. Hi. I said a whole thing and hello with being on mute. I think that is our 2020 tagline, isn't it, Nandini? For all me. <laughs> <laughs> Well, welcome everybody for the monsoon dance virtual recital, and we promise to be unmuted now and keeping you guys entertained and super, super dancing and uh, uh, for the next one, one and a half hour now. Uh, what you're gonna see in the next uh, hour with us is a bunch of dance presentations put together by our students and instructors. And along with me to present some of this is uh, our instructor, Miss Nandini. Um, Nandini Hello, has been teaching outdoor classes for our teens uh, for the last couple of months. So Nandini, 2020 has been a interesting year, right? How how has it been? Yes, it's been interesting. The, because of the COVID situation, taking classes outdoor, it's been a challenge. And at the same time, it's fun. It I was super excited teaching the kids all the dance classes. And I'm excited to see all the performance. Hope everyone are also excited. <laughs> <laughs> excellent. Excellent. Yes. Um, so, you know, let's start off the show with... A sort of a little bit of um, what our in, what we as instructors felt teaching um, through 2020. I think uh, that'll be a nice uh, place to start, just so that everybody knows uh, what we went through and our students and dancers went through in 2020. Um, and uh, let's start there. Yep. Life is not about waiting for the storms to pass. It's about learning to dance in the rains. Our monsoon gurus are the best example of this commitment and dedication. Through this pandemic, for the last six months, this team of heroes have been teaching classes from our studio to your homes every day. So what are you waiting for? Come join. Get exhilarated. Get enthused. Get a workout. Find your zen. And most importantly, find yourself.
that brought, brought, brought like a bunch of memories, didn't it? Yes, 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 for sure. Especially the classes where people are wearing the masks the initial time. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> That's right. And I remember you were teaching um, the 7 p.m. fitness classes for almost a good five, six months, right? Yes. Oh, my yes, gosh. Yes. yes. So this year has been just full of memories. I can't believe it's getting to an end and, uh, you know, before even noticing it kind of started. But all of us are going to be different people, I think. So let's learn a little bit about, I think I want to start the show by playing just a few videos by um, learning a little bit about monsoon dance, because this year, yes, we have been a little different, but everything that we do in all other years, right from our recital, I mean, this is our virtual recital, but usually recitals feel so different, the backstage drama, the front, the lights, the you know, the lights, action, camera experience. Um, I think we had that, but we just had it very different this year. So I think I wanna play maybe a couple of videos uh, just to uh, for, for everybody here to get to know Monsoon a little bit better in the beginning of the show before we get into the recital. Sound good? All right. Well, that was a little bit about us as Monsoon Dance for everybody who's watching. 
uh, and you haven't tried a class with us, we offer free trials for our outdoor classes, virtual 7 p.m. fitness classes, kids classes, uh, and even the in-studio uh, sessions as well. So feel free to always reach out to us. All right, so that was a little bit about us. Uh, what do we have in store for us, Nandini? What's next? So next, we're going to start showing all the performances by different students. And we start this by the first song, which is going to be Rajwadi Odhani, which is done by Samaya and Anaya uh, from the kids' outdoor class, which is usually at Sunday at 4 p.m. So I'm excited to see the dance. What about you, Shruti? Oh my gosh, yes, these kids are amazing. And you know what the fun thing is that they're gonna be dancing together, but they had they have not performed this song together. They have never been in the studio together at the same point. So I think the uh, Samaya and Anaya are gonna enjoy watching themselves dance together. This is the yeah. magic of technology and uh, creativity coming together, right? Yes, so let's watch the dance next. All right. I just loved her for it. Yeah, that was a very good performance. I loved how both of them had super energy and with the dandia sticks, how they were dancing and how the background was at the back. It would just blended in very well. So uh, do you want to go ahead with what the next performance is going to be, Shruti? Yeah, so I am particularly excited about the next one because I have two students uh, of mine in the next one from Kids Level 3 class on Wednesdays at 5.30. And um, one of the students is uh, my daughter's friend and the other student is my own daughter. So Neil and Naomi are going to be presenting one of their favorite songs, Dump Dump. It's an older song. I don't know how they took on to that song, but they love it. They love Anushka uh, and, uh, uh, and Ran Ranjit, I think is the actor okay. there. And he's, uh, yes, right? And then, uh, he, I think they're just amazing dancers. So um, let's see Neil and Naomi reenact their passion for dance and Bollywood uh, in this next song. Uh, so let's go for it. Okay. 
was a very good performance. <laughs> I know I always get tears in my eyes when I watch these kids perform, even on stage. And now I'm experiencing that sitting alone in a room. <laughs> I love so, the expression. I, like the expressions yes. were too good. Like, like. <laughs> so you know, usually this experience is so different sitting uh, in front of uh, the stage, watching these kids perform, and. Uh, this recital usually, obviously, you know, this is at the holiday time frame and all of us instructors and I'm glad you're wearing the Santa hat because that's what we do for our holiday <laughs> recital. All of us instructors wear Santa hats and it's a big celebration. We usually have a party uh, after the recital with like food and certificates. So we are missing all of that a little uh, this year. But I'm just so happy to see all the students dancing together uh, and sharing it with sort of everybody. I mean, usually it's just within uh, the performance theater, but now everybody gets to see it around the world. So I think that that's the positive out of this. Um, so through this pandemic, it's been a very tough year for arts and, you know, creative arts, dance, as you know, right? And I think our city has played a particularly a very big place uh, to keep small businesses grow, going through this pandemic. And I wanted to sort of um, introduce my very dear friend, um, council member, Alison Alter, um, who actually sent us some Diwali wish wishes and uh, showing her support for, um, for our school and uh, you know just South Asians and arts and the Indian American community in Austin. Um, and so I wanted to play her message. Uh, she is up for uh, re-election right now. Uh, in her District 10. District 10, a lot of our students live in District 10. So if you are um, a, a eligible voter, then please go back. I know we're done with voting already, but there is uh, there is the runoffs going on right now, like till December 15th. So make sure you go and cast your vote for this council member, uh, council member Alter, because she is the most amazing supporter of South Asian community in Austin, creative arts, and all of us who are watching, I know, uh, either support creative arts, love dance, uh, are in the Indian American community. So please, please help her get uh, reelected. Also, my friend, Council Member Flanagan, is up for reelection for District 6, which is where our studio is based. So if you are in District 6, please go vote for him. So let's do a, a, get a little political civic engagement and listen to Alison talking for the next two or three minutes. Good morning. My name is Alison Alter, and it is my honor to represent District 10. Central Northwest Austin on the Austin City Council. District 10 runs from the river north through Great Hills and I'm proud to represent many of you. Today I'm excited to join with you to celebrate Diwali and the beauty of dance and the arts. Diwali is a special holiday for me and my family. My husband UT professor Jeremy Surrey is half Indian and I'm the mother of two wonderful Indian American teenagers. As a council member, I've had the honor to recognize Indian independence, and to join with the Indian American community each summer for the Parade of India, highlighting India as an example of a diverse democracy and recognizing the many contributions of our Indian American community right here in Austin. I wish we could join together today in person, but I'm confident that Shruti and Monsoon Dance will put together an amazing program that shares the light and the joy of Diwali and reminds us at this dark time why we value the arts and culture. I've had the privilege to travel to India four times. The last time I led the city of Austin's delegation to Pune, India, where we cemented our sister city relationship. While I've never experienced Diwali in India, the day I landed in Pune was the start of the Ganesh festival. And I will never forget joining the parade and greeting the folks alongside the mayor and among the drummers. From those travels, I know how much art and music run deep in the Indian soul. I also know they run deep in Austin. What a wonderful treat it is for Austin that monsoon dance exists to enrich us all. I wanna thank Shruti and monsoon dance for this opportunity to speak with you also about my reelection. My name is Allison Alter and I'm running for reelection to represent district 10 on the Austin city council. Early voting runs until December 11th and election day is December 15th. I am proud of my record to make Austin a place where all can thrive and feel safe. I have advanced the development of the Asian American Resource Center, condemned hatred and discrimination, supported minority owned businesses, invested in our parks and our trails, 
worked to combat the climate crisis, accelerated our wildfire mitigation efforts, increased our EMS resources, and creatively worked to improve our public health delivery. In this pandemic, I provided financial relief to individuals and organizations, small businesses, nonprofits, childcare, and our iconic venues, and worked to protect the most vulnerable. For me, public safety is a top priority, and I believe we can and should strive to root out racism and ensure public safety. I'm proud to be endorsed by the Austin American Statesman, the Austin Chronicle, Trustee Arti Singh, ACC Trustee Sean Hassan, and many more elected officials. I also have been endorsed by former candidates Pratesh Gandhi and Pooja Sethi. I'm proud to have the endorsement of the Austin Firefighters Association, the EMS Association, the Sierra Club, the Travis County Democratic Party, and many other organizations. My name is Allison Alter, and I invite you to learn more about what I've accomplished at allisonalter.com. I hope I've earned your vote to continue representing Austin City Council District 10. Please remember to vote in the runoff. Election day is December 15th, and happy Diwali. Thank you. All right. Well, that was uh, a very nice message of uh, support from uh, our friend, Council Member Alter. Uh, she's wonderful. She's come to so many of our events, Parade of India that we've done every single year till this year. This year we did it virtually and she was there. Uh, so she's just been an amazing supporter and I really hope we can help her in every possible way, keep her in office. Um, so Nandini, what's, what's next after the political message? What's next? Yes, so the next is one of my favorite songs, Chum Chum, which was danced by Shraddha Kapoor and Tiger Shroff, and I love Tiger Shroff dancing. And this song is going to be performed by the kid of level three, which is Gia, which uh, she comes on Wednesday 5.30 class. So I'm excited to see how, how the video and her dance is going to come along. Let's see how it is. Oh, she is a wonderful Chum 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 Raindrop bouncing, my heart is announcing you got to take me away. Let's start jumping, my heart goes pumping. I love you in every way. Her gun up and boom the jogiri. That was a very nice performance. I think you're a mute, Shruti. Unmute yourself. <laughs> oh <my God>. <laughs> <laughs> All right. So how do you make the performance? <laughs> that was an amazing performance. And you know what I love about uh, Gia and the song as well? Is it sort of a spirit of monsoon dance song? I mean, we are about <laughs> dancing in the rain. <laughs> Me, that, that dance shows that emotion so beautifully. Um, so yeah, I mean, what? that was a great performance. I'm sorry, I'm, so, I'm sorry. I just spoke in the middle. I'm sorry about it. So what do we have next? Uh, what, the next one is Urvashi, and this one features the remix version of Urvashi with uh, Shahid Kapoor and Kiera. And I know that this song was choreographed by uh, Miss Rika, our instructor, for our level one kids upon their request because 
apparently some of them loved Shahid Kapoor. Um, so our student Leah from the Tuesday 5.30 p.m. class is going to be dancing with Shahid Kapoor in this next one. So get ready. <laughs> <laughs> Start the beat. So what do you think? That was nice, especially I liked her energy when Urvasi started. She was like all jumping Urvasi, Urvasi. I know. It, it looked so I nice. I only yeah. five years old, and it must be tough for them to perform like sort of by themselves without yes, their instructors yes. because usually the, in, the recital us instructors are so we offer that moral support with the, with the students, right? And they're sort of doing this all by themselves now in the front of the camera. So I'm sure it's intimidating, but I'm so proud of all our students. Now it's time to get uh, Leah's instructor, Miss Rita's feature Rita. on. <laughs> and I think after this one, Nandini, um, you and I are handing it over to Rekha and Arvind for Kampir, right? Yes, yes. That's right. So very excited <laughs> for Rekha and Arvind to compare the next segment and uh, Rekha teaches a lot of our kids classes and uh, Arvind, who's also your husband, uh, probably <laughs> listening around right now. <laughs> uh, Arvind is, uh, there you go, so Arvind's already, I, I know that in the center hut, there we go. <laughs> so um, Arvind teaches our 7 p.m. fitness classes. He's also planning to take a bunch of choreography workshops, I know, for like advanced choreo, which Arvind, the, the last one you did was fabulous. I can't wait to see that, uh, do it again with you. So hopefully we can get a few started soon in the new year for all the, uh, the dancers in Austin to join and start dancing together, right? So can't wait. Yeah. All right, so let's get uh, Miss Rekha on the stage now and see her beautiful presentation with the backdrop of Indian palaces. And uh, me and Nandini are gonna sign off for now and uh, we will transition to Arvind and Miss Rekha. All right.
Hello, Hi, everyone. Hi, Rika. That was fantastic. Fantastic. Uh, your Hi. expressions Thank were you amazing. So the drop was amazing. Hi, everyone. My name is Arvin. That's Rika. I can't figure out from my from my head Christmas hat. Um, <laughs> Well, before we get started, I just wanted to thank everybody for being here. 2020 has been a challenging year with uh, with the pandemic and everything. But uh, having said that, you know, it's moments like this uh, that that make my year and make make little moments of joy, um, where you know you see you see uh, uh, the team with Shruti and everybody overcoming the challenges, having online classes at the same time, you know, uh, doing dancing and make and and with such brilliant edits like this, you know, it seems like Rekha is dancing to the actual video of the song. <laughs> so it's right. absolutely <laughs> great work. Uh, the closest Rekha. that I can get to the real movie, right? So. Yeah. <laughs> I'm not sure about that after this performance. <laughs> <laughs> but. Uh, so, so Rekha, we'll we'll run through the next section. Um, uh, so, what do we have in store for us? Uh, the next performance uh, is is uh, is something that uh, with, by Shruti, myself, and Nandini on the song Guleba. <laughs> yeah. So, uh, Guleba is a super hit Tamil song. It is danced by none other than the king of South Indian uh, dance, is Mr. Prabhu Deva. And um, I'm sure you guys will enjoy this rocking performance. Arvind, I believe you choreographed it. Yeah, it, it was me and my friend who choreographed it. But but the interesting part was Shruti learned this in rocket speed. Um, I, I was <laughs> teaching uh, uh, what I was thinking was the first pass. Um, uh, and, and Shruti just got all the steps really quickly. And we did this. Uh, and it was super fun to do this. Um, uh, yeah. So let's go ahead and watch, watch, watch uh, Guleba. So even though that wasn't Guleba, that was better dancing than what I believe me, Shruti and Nandini danced. <laughs> I do think so. so. I did such a cute job there. Such a great job. Uh, yes. So we will we will try to get back on track. And here is Guleba for everyone. Yep. <laughs> Hey, 
Well, I think you guys did a fabulous job there. I can't even tell that Shruti learned this in the last minute. And as a Tamil speaker, I think that was a song that I want to learn how to dance to. <laughs> Let's do it. Uh, we we we'll get you dancing. <laughs> so, yes, and as you can see with all all the red red tops there, we got into Christmas spirit uh, a couple of months with back itself. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> that is so the, the the next song is going to be Chitiya Kalaiya. It's one of my favorite songs from the movie Roy. It's sung by Kanika Kapoor um, um, and uh, I, think, I believe Jacqueline Fernandez uh, is the one uh, dancing to this song, and it's it's absolutely great. Who is performing it for us, uh, Rekha? We have Nia, Aliza, and Salva, and they came to Monsoon for a private session. They are three rows that are going to perform to this peppy number. Uh, Arvind, are you muted? Now I'm not. <laughs> that was that was so cute, wasn't it? Yes, and it's unbelievable. At such a young age, they have to coordinate. They have to move along with the music. There's a lot of brain power involved right there. I can confidently say I wasn't doing any of that when I was three years old. <laughs> yeah, for sure. Neither was uh, I. Moving on to our next performance. This is again um, uh, the Urvashi song. If you remember a couple of songs back, we had a wonderful choreography by Rekha Ibeem uh, for the Urvashi song. And, and we are going to do that again. Um, um, who, who is performing this time, uh, uh, Rekha? So um, Myra and uh, Divyesh are doing this performance. I am super excited because they are the kids that I see every Tuesday night, unfortunately through Zoom, but at least I get to teach virtually. Um, so uh, let's go ahead and uh, see how they have done this uh, Urvashi song. <laughs> Start the beat.
That but, was so oops, great. I got the name wrong. <laughs> go ahead, go ahead, Rika. We had little five-year-old Aditi perform uh, Urvashi for us remotely. I apologize for the uh, wrong performer names. Um, Aditi has been joining us from East Coast um, over the pandemic, uh, and we are very happy that we are able to stretch beyond Austin and teach kids outside of Austin as well. Great, and and, and the next song uh, is is an, a little older song, about nine years old. Uh, it's uh, th the Tara Rampam song. Um, it's uh, uh, from it's the title song of Tara Rampam. It's Saif Ali Khan and. Rani Mukherjee, where, where in that movie, uh, it's a great, cute little song. Um, uh, who, who do we have performing? Uh, so this time for sure, I have Myra and uh, Divyesh again from my Tuesday at 5.30 p.m. class. And um, I'm ready and excited to see them work, uh, perform. Ready a story, a story about four guys, Ta, Ra, Ma, and pa. so cute it brought back the memories of the song i had not listened to the song in so much time um also what the yeah. reminds <laughs> me remind, reminded me or taught me is that if you forget one or two steps just continue and act confident uh, which, is, <laughs> which is what he did I, I i have a blank look on my face so i learned that from the <laughs> <laughs> that is true that is true and it's nice to see the two of them together virtually for sure Absolutely, absolutely, and also, um, uh, you know, uh, earlier when we when we saw uh, uh, Aditi dance, uh, you know, at the end she gave a look, and we, you know, when we teach dance, we always say stage presence and give a nice uh, attitude and a look, and that that came out well. So through this recital with with kids that are just three and five years old, I'm learning so much. Uh, I'm enjoying these performances. Uh, so yeah, to, to move on. Yes. Next, we have a rock star, a monsoon rock star, right? Uh, dancing to the song Diwani Mastani. Uh, I'll, I'll, I'll let That's you speak true. about the rock star. <laughs> we have a talented Miss Teju, who, is, uh, who teaches advanced level classes, fitness classes. She's also taught some kids' classes. Um, and she will be performing to another palace number. So, um, along with the rest of us. And Rekha, just uh, before we head to, head on to the performance, after that song, we will be handing handing the baton back over to Shruti. Yeah. That is true. You guys will see Shruti back again. Yeah. Love you, everyone. नजर जो तेरी लागी मैं दीवानी हो गई दीवानी हाँ दीवानी दीवानी हो गई मैं 
मशहूर मेरे इश्क की कहानी हो गई जो जग ने न मानी तो मैंने भी ठानी कहा भी मैं देखो कहा चली आई कहते हैं ये दीवानी मस्तानी All right. Hey, everybody. So I'm back. Rekha, Arvind, thank you so much for comparing the previous segment. That was awesome, you guys. I know we had a few technical glitches, but you guys swim through it just fine. So thank you so much. Uh, me, you know, being um, here in monsoon dance, I miss having all my instructors, you know, around me. And this year, particularly, we, we haven't been able to spend the time together that we usually do. But I am so thankful for this amazing team of instructors that we have here. I mean, they're all talented, extremely professional, so, so, so experienced. And without them, you know, there is no monsoon dance. So, and I feel that every time I see them talking about dance, they're students and just so passionate. So thank you so much, all of our monsoon instructors, whether you're comparing today or being part of the show today, but if you are a monsoon instructor, thank you very much. This, this goes out to you. Um, all right, so our next song, it's actually a song that we saw previously, but we didn't get a chance to introduce my student Ishan and his uh, fabulous passion that he has for Tiger Shroff, for Bollywood dance. And uh, this student actually, he didn't dance much before the pandemic. Think about that. He thought that uh, dancing was for girls and now here he is he can't stop dancing he is totally bitten by the bug and he totally will refute himself the part where dancing is for uh, for girls he dances with so much passion and is so good at it and i think he's going to go a long way with his dance training so everybody let's put together our hands for ishan on mumbai delhi ki kahani
All right. Well, wasn't that fabulous, you guys? Next, we have uh, Ashka and her friend Carson, who learned this choreography in a private group at Monsoon. We've been doing a lot of small group sessions, especially through COVID. So people who are in a little bio bubble or cousins or family basically come and take their own private class at Monsoon uh, just to be uh, keeping it safe for everybody, right? I mean, our instructors in the studio are masked and um, that way we kind of contain two or three kids here at a time. It's a pretty big space. Um, so yeah, we've been doing a lot of private group sessions and small groups and um, you know, this is our Ashka, uh, our students Ashka and Carson and they're gonna be doing a non-Bollywood song now. It's called Sugar by Maroon 5. So everybody, let's put together your hands for Ashka and Carson. So what do you guys think? Wasn't that something? All right. So next we have um, we have Ella and Rhea, and they are dancing to another non Bollywood number that they learned in their small group private session. Um, and this one is Happy by uh, William Farrell. And this is a very fun song with a very fun backdrop because it involves i won't give it up too much but it involves some of the famous characters and uh the uh, rhea and ella were extremely excited about dancing with these favorite characters of theirs so i will let you go ahead and uh watch this video and tell us what you think of the overall performance
All right. Well, I hope you all enjoyed that very, very, very much. Our next performance is a instructor feature again by one of our most awesome instructors, very committed instructors. In fact, uh, she started out as a student of monsoon dance about four or five years ago. Her name is Shweta Gurung. And uh, coincidentally, her teacher's name is the same. Her teacher's name is Shweta Vasudeva. Uh, Shweta has been my partner in monsoon dance for ever, I think. And uh, Shweta Vasudeva teaches or used to teach the classes down south. Now she teaches it from the studio, the studio of her Chile online. But, um, and hopefully, next year we can get back to our south classes and shweta gurung is also was one of her students down south and now she also teaches with monsoon dance and she's just a fabulous dancer she's come such a long way in her dance learning and um you know just love having her on board so shweta is going to be performing another palacio number more bollywood in style it's called dhoom tana from movie om shanti om so hope you all enjoy it Right. Well, that was just wonderful performance by my our instructor, Ms. Shweta Gurung, right? All right. So the next one is by another instructor, one of our favorite instructors who teaches on Wednesday nights at 7 p.m. She is most known for her amazing uh, Bollywood fitness uh, combo, combo style with uh, Zumba, since she's trained a uh, Zumba instructor as well. Her name is Miss Shika. And Miss Shika, you're going to see a different side of her today. She is performing a Marathi folk song, again, with a beautiful palatial backdrop, like a princess. Uh, this is a Marathi song by the name of Apsara Ali. And uh, it's just a classic song. And she is so graceful, so amazing in that song that I am sure you will love watching her. So let's put your hands together for Miss Shika.
Shika, that was wonderful. You looked so amazing doing that dance. Thank you. Thank you so much, Shruti. And that was my first ever green screen experience and I enjoyed doing it a lot. So, <laughs> well, hello everyone. Yeah. So, hello everyone. This is me, Shika, and I've been uh, with Monsoon for almost two years now. And my journey with Monsoon has been really wonderful, especially during this uh, COVID-19 situation when everything else was at halt, but Monsoon dance was still on and I had something to look forward to. And every Wednesday I could put my shoes on and step out of the house and go to studio and dance and exercise virtually with my students. So it, re it was really helpful physically as well as mentally. So and it's good to be a part of monsoon dance and the team <laughs> thank you thank so, you Shika, that you summarized it so well i mean the the dance and the yoga and the studio has truly kept all of us just healthy from a physical perspective through this pandemic absolutely right and yes the mental health i mean it has been a blessing to just have this um, this avenue where you can connect with people, uh, like-minded people virtually, dance virtually, and you know I am too, just like you. So 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 thankful. Uh, so thank you for being here, Shika. What what are we watching next? Okay, so for the next performance, Shruti, we have one of the most uh, like uh, one of the most. Um, uh, uh, it's a very nice dance number and the best thing about this number is that uh, two of the best dancers from Bollywood, they perform together for the first time and yes, I'm talking about Hrithik Roshan and Tiger Shroff and the song is Jaja Shiv Shankar and mood is Bhayankar and you know what Shruti, the lyrics is very apt for this song because of this, uh, uh, the groovy beats and the energy which uh, Tiger Shroff and Rithik Roshan they bring to the dance, it just gets gets uh, us, you know, into the mood to dance. So yes, uh, I uh, it's one of my favorite song. So and but who's performing? Uh, let's uh, uh, yeah, you so need let's, to tell let's us. Put together our hands for Aprisha, who is our kids level one student learning virtually. Um, she's in Austin, but she's learning virtually and she could come to the studio for the green screen. And I think she's going to be super excited to see herself dance with Ritik Roshan and Tiger Shroff. So let's put our hands together wow. for Prisha on Jai Jai Shri Shankar. Excited. Right. she was so cute yeah she is yes yeah, she was so what's what's next shika okay so the next song is again we we've seen it a uh, couple of uh, the, uh, items back it, uh, it's again by tiger shroff and it's called mumbai delhi the kuriya from the movie student of the year 2 along with tara sutaria and ananya pandey and it's another peppy song with foot tapping beats and it looks so beautiful so fresh with all the colors in the background and i'm looking forward to seeing it and who's yes, performing I mean, on this one 
Yeah, so this one is by our student Reva. And uh, Reva is a remote student. She's in Austin, but she's a remote student in our virtual classes. And she didn't feel comfortable coming to the green screen uh, shoot, which is, you know, I mean, everybody is taking this pandemic differently. So she sent a video of herself and we were able to bring her into the song uh, with just getting her video. So she's our kids level three student. She also learns with Ishan, but um, you know, she's gonna be doing the song by herself. And uh, so let's put together our hands for Reva on Mumbai Delhi Ki Kuriya. Yes, yes. All right. So what do we have in store for us next, Shika? Okay, so next song, Shruti, is based on modern tales of Radha and Krishna. And as usual, as always, Radha is taunting Krishna and Krishna is teasing Radha. And the song is called Radha Teri Chunri from the movie Student of the Year. And you know what, Shruti? Uh, without this iconic song, no party or wedding is complete without playing this That's song. Right. So, yes. So let's see who's performing on this song, Shruti. So this one, yes, yeah, so this one is going to be presented by three of our students from our Sunday outdoor class for kids at four o'clock. And uh, these kids, yes, they meet outdoors, you know, in a more safe environment. All Everybody is away from each other in the parking lot right next to our studio. But in the recording of this green screen recital, they were all in um, separate, they came into the studio at separate times, so one at a time. So they are going to be super yeah. excited to see them all be together in this next video because they're all dancing together without really dancing physically together, right? So it's kind of interesting. And yes, it's a quite an iconic song, like you said. So let's put our hands uh, together for uh, Pranavi, Vaishali, and Samaya. Yay.
Wow. And I, I do want to correct myself. I said Samaya in the previous song and in introducing, but it was actually Kirti. They're all in the same class and all of our classes learned multiple songs so that they can perform in smaller groups. But that was Kirti along with Vaishali and Pranavi. So I know if, if Kirti is watching, she will not forgive me for not saying her name. So I have to correct myself right there. You know how kids and uh, kids are with their teachers, right? Teachers, we can't really make a lot of, we can't really make mistakes with our students, especially their names. So all of us at Monsoon, uh, we really try to remember their students' names for that, uh, our students' names for that for that reason. Um, so yeah, anyways, that was Kirti, Vaishali, and Pranavi. And uh, what's what's coming up next? Yeah, so again, uh, we have uh, Guleba again, the same song which you performed, Arvind, uh, along with Arvind and Nandini. And yes, yeah. uh, what I uh, like about this song, because it's one of my favorite dancer, Prabhu Deva features in that song, our own Indian Michael Jackson. And uh, uh, we, we have been seeing him dancing uh, since our childhood, the first ever song, Urvashin, Mukabla. And it's always uh, uh, eyes to uh, treat to eyes to watch him on the screen dancing. So again, once again, it's Guleba's song, and it's a, it's in from South Indian movie, and uh, who's performing on on this song, Shruti? So this one is actually Nandini's student, um, Nandini, who was our, um, you know, she was hosting earlier part of the show, our instructor for the outdoor choreography classes. So she uh, taught this song to Prisha, uh, her teen student. She has a few students in that class and Prisha decided to do a, re a rehearsal on this, uh, a recital on this. So let's put your hands together, everybody, for uh, Prisha performing to Guleba. <laughs> performance uh, it's truly amazing lovely, lovely performance. so tell me what are we seeing next shika so shruti for the next performance i'm going to i'm going to take you all to a place which is extravagant and it's magnificent and everything about this song is so beautiful the song the dance the lyrics the costume and everything and uh, it features the dancing diva Madhuri Dikshit and Shah Rukh Khan and it's uh, the song is called Kahe Chede from the movie Dev Das and, uh, uh, and uh, Shruti will tell us who's performing uh, on this song but here I'll be yes and before I'll uh, sign off I just wanted to say you know I've never interacted with these kids before but it was wonderful to see them dancing virtually and I really enjoyed uh, all the performance here so thank all you, right Shrita. so thank, thank you all you. thank you Shruti thank you everyone and Shruti will <laughs> take over now and tell us who's performing on this beautiful number you know, I am not going to say who's performing because I think I know who's performing. So I will just let the video start and hopefully people recognize who is performing. How about that? <laughs> <laughs> I'm sure they will. <laughs> Ma 
Shweta, you, uh, Shweta is our celebrity instructor. I wasn't sure if she was going to be able to make it, and I'm sure she she looks like you're at a shoot right now. So, you know, t tell tell us a little bit about it. What what have you been up to? I know you're teaching at Monsoon, totally committed to your students, but I know you do so much more. So tell us about it. Yes, so first, hello everyone who's watching this show. Uh, it was an amazing, amazing display of amazing performances by everyone. Uh, so yes, I was busy with uh, one of my shoot in the morning. I'm also shooting for the International Indian Icon. And there's also a show coming called Bethak, which is a cultural extravaganza where a lot of uh, you know artists all over the globe are participating so i was shooting for that and you know this covid the one positive thing is that we have got connected to everyone everywhere you know we don't have to be in person so i i am you know using this opportunities to connect everyone even outside usa for that matter so yes it's got us closer what do you say shruti I think so too, you know, it's uh, like, um, I think uh, Shweta was, um, or Rekha was talking about her uh, student in the East Coast. I know I have students like all over the US at this time, and I've been looking at our Facebook feed and people from all over the world are watching this right now. So yes, it has brought us together uh, globally. It is so unfortunate. I mean, there's the, the unfortunate part of COVID I mean, you know, it's just too sad to even talk about it, but always as humans, we are optimists and we try to find silver lining to things, right? So this is, you're right about certainly that this is silver lining and we hope we all survive this with least scars and we are back together stronger than ever next year. So yeah, so thank you so much for being here, Shweta. I know you're a, you're a very busy person. I'm just happy to see you here. Uh, so let's let's introduce the next segment. So the next one is a Natch Mary Rani um, cover by my student and my older daughter, Roma. And uh, Roma is a big fan of Nora Fatehi, just like you, Shweta. Yes? Yeah, me too, me too. I'm a big fan, yes. 
<laughs> so Nora, so when this song came out during the pandemic, uh, Roma had so many ideas about how she wanted to do it. And as a mom and as a teacher and as somebody who was putting, doing the technology part of the show, I tried to do my best with giving her what she wanted. And she did her best in really putting together a fabulous performance for us. So let's put together our hands for uh, Roma Anand doing Nach Meri Rani. Thank you. You know, it's uh, this one, uh, Roma. <laughs> you know, I enjoyed doing this honestly, and uh, with this one, Roma was uh, it was watching someone watching behind your shoulder while you're working on the video kind of deal. So I wouldn't have added that many effects in videos. I'm not a big fan of too many effects in videos, but I had to let loose a little bit of this one because Roma really <laughs> likes to do effects. As you can tell, a nine-year-old child wanted to do a lot of effects for her songs when she got the freedom and the ability to do that. And she actually edits and produces some of these videos herself. You'll be surprised how much they can learn. I mean, in this crisis, kids have learned to interact with technology so much right. for good and for bad, right? I mean, this next set of students that we're gonna be introducing, nine mm -hmm. of them, all of them are in my level one class on Mondays uh, at 5.30 mm -hmm. and they all learn virtually and it's just amazing. They've been doing this for the last uh, couple, more than a couple of months now. And they're so good at interacting on Zoom, you know, unmuting themselves, muting themselves. Sometimes I have to restrict what they can do on Zoom, like putting, playing around with backgrounds and ch chatting, private chatting with each other on the side, which is totally restricted. So we have to, you know, the kids learn fast and as instructors teaching them virtually, we have to just keep up with them at this point, right? Absolutely, absolutely. So, um, so yeah, the next one is our, we are kind of at the end of the show here. Um, and our next um, performance is going to be on another of our uh, your favorite songs which is funny uh, you had actually done a cover with uh, this one with miss uh, rahi and miss teju it's uh, ye uh, jawani hai diwani oh ye jawani hai okay awesome awesome yes yes so tell us tell me what what you like about the song shweta before we introduce our grand finale number here uh yeah it is one of the retro songs you know which was remixed and got into uh, this uh, movie called Student of the Year, and I really love mm -hmm. the upbeat, you know, all and also the retro feel. So yeah, it's really really nice song, very peppy. Yep, very peppy. And you know, it's surprising. We taught for this recital. Uh, each class learned uh, about two or three songs that they could pick from on which they wanted to participate in, which is kind of different than what we usually do for recitals, right? Recital, we are working towards one choreography, but this time that was yeah. a little different. And um, 
out of the 10 or 11 kids in the class, nine of them picked this song. So that's why you're going to see a lot of them dancing together because it is a very peppy and attractive song. So everybody, Absolutely. let's put together our hands, and there is a long list of names here, for Advait, Anushka, Gaushik, Harindra, Lina, Karnika, Ruhan, Siddharth, and Zico performing to Ye Jawani, Hai Diwani. Wasn't that awesome? Awesome, awesome, fantastic performance. <laughs> they are all, you can't believe it or not, but all these kids, some of them are in Austin, some of them are in Texas area, and some of wow. them are in, well, one of them I know is in Florida. Some of them contacted me saying it's too cold, it's snowing outside, so we can't really take a video outside. So I think we have students so in so many places right now, and it's just amazing to see them all dancing together. Every time I see my students dancing, I'm like, oh my gosh, I just can't, That's you know. <laughs> That's the spirit, you know. Uh, yes. They say, right, when the going gets tough, the tough gets going. So all you all, like, kudos to everyone. You know, amazing, amazing job by everyone. Yep. Thank you. Thank you, Shweta. And, you know, thank you. I'm so glad you could join the very last part of this recital in between your shoot because, you know, there is there hasn't been a recital at Monsoon without you at this time. I mean, you have been with me throughout this journey, through when it was easy, through when it has been extremely tough this year. 
so I so I said this before, I have to say it again. I appreciate having all you amazing instructors and your commitment to uh, the studio and to our students. We really are, I think, bringing happiness to so many people uh, as a team. So, you know, I really, really appreciate having you here today and you as a part of Monsoon always. Thank you so much, Shruti. Uh, all thanks to you. And, you know, of course, yeah, I've never uh, missed any of the recitals and that's why I couldn't stop myself even joining in the last <laughs> minute. Uh, everyone watching, this was not planned. This is like, you know, right on the spot. Uh, but yes, I feel great that I could make it. Uh, and yes, all kudos to you, Shruti. I think the recital, the virtual recital, uh, which was done so wonderfully. I love the graphics as well as the performance. And uh, Shruti is a great leader is all I can say. She always brings in new and innovative ideas. And if I can say this, then people follow. So that says a lot about you. <laughs> Kudos to you for Thank that. you. You're, you're too kind. Like I said, I can't do this without the amazing team and amazing people I have. Thank you so much, everybody, for watching and encouraging our students on social media, on live stream. Um, just being here for us and for our students means a lot to us, and it gives us the energy to keep going through the tough. And hopefully, we are stronger and better. And as the pandemic you know, goes away next year, I'm an optimist, can't help it. We will all be soon dancing together and attending events together live. So thank you so much, everybody, for watching. Thank you, Shweta, again, for being here. You can always um, follow us on Facebook if you're not following us already, because we will post this whole segment uh, on Vimeo there. And that way, you all can watch it at your convenience whenever you want. So thank you so much. And we are going to conclude with another one of our videos that we started the show off, which was about about our teaching and our students in and our instructors in this unique year 2020. So thank you so much, everybody. Yeah, thank you.